Loading of any additional content requires version 2.0 of the OS or better. New content will always load into user banks, factory objects are not affected. Although you can load multiple files into the SP4, the load interface only permits loading one file at a time. First to get started, go to the support and knowledge base section of our website and pull up the SP47. If you select global mode, you'll see there are loading sound banks. If you click on that, it will present to you a detailed list of instructions on how to get new sounds into your SP4. First turn on the SP4 and your computer and attach a USB cable. Select global mode, press the channel parameter button down until you see the load fill option. And just for example here, I'm going to go to the download section of our website, pull up the SP4, and I'm going to load these new synth sounds. I'll download that, pull that up in the download section, and back on the SP4, I'm going to hit next, and I'll see press next again for loading. Now I'm going to want to click and drag that new synth file directly into the SP4 temporary drive. Pressing previous will cancel the load operation and recall the load fill dialog. If no file is in the SP4 during the load, the display will show load error. If the SP4 is not connected to a computer, the display will show the error message, please connect the computer. I'm going to hit next again, and I'll load that file directly in. You'll see this message and you can cancel or ignore it. To play the new sounds, go back to program mode, press the bank selection down to user, and I'll see there on the display all my new synth sounds.